Hello, everybody. It's me, Mr. Steve, and it's time for another story time. Da da da. Today, I'm going to be reading this book, Dr. Seuss's Oh, the Thinks You Can Think. I really like Dr. Seuss, The Cat in the Hat, Green Eggs and Ham. He's a good author, and I like it, but for some reason I don't particularly like this book. It feels like he's just making up things. Oh, look, there's a flop, and a jippity jop, and a slop, and a mop, and a hoppity pop, and it's just, I don't know. But if you like the book, that's fine. It's okay for us to disagree with each other. We can still be friends. So we're going to read this book, and it's called Oh, the Thinks You Can Think. Let's get to reading. You can think up some birds. That's what you can do. The end. You know what I like about that book? It's a short one. It's a short one. I like that. Well, there's now time for my favorite thing in the world. Nap time! Uh, sorry, sorry. Fell asleep there for a second. Oh, there's more to the book. I'm sorry, there's more to the book. I thought that was it. You can think up some birds. That's what you can do. You can think about yellow or think about blue. I really like the color blue. You can think about red. You can think about pink. You can think up a horse. Oh, the things you can think. I'm going to find a mouth. A Seven Nation Army couldn't hold me back. Oh, the things you can think up if only you try. If you try, you can think up a guff going by. And you don't have to stop. You can think about schlop. Schlop, schlop, beautiful schlop, beautiful schlop with a cherry on top. Yeah, okay. You can just call it ice cream. Dr. Seuss. Dr. Extra. You can think about gloves. You can think about snubs. You can think for a long time about snubs and their gloves. You can think about Kitty O'Sullivan Krause in her big balloon swimming pool over her house. Not safe. Not safe, Kitty. Not safe. Think of black water. Think up a white sky. Think up a boat. Think of bloogs blowing by. Those are just Pokemon. That's all they are. They're just Pokemon. You can think about night. A night in Nunup. The birds are asleep and the three moons are up. Oh, so like uh, 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 Tatooine is what we're talking about here. Okay, that's fine. You can think about day. A day in the Dake. The water is blue and the birds are awake. Think, think and wonder, wonder and think. How much water can 55 elephants drink? It was going to be 56, but one of them found a tiny flower, and inside of it was Whoville. Oh. You can wonder, how long is the tail of a zong? There are so many thinks that a thinker can think. Would you dare yank a tooth of the Rick Rinker fink? Uh. And what would you do if you met a Jaboo? Hey, that might be Slenderman. That might be Slenderman. Who does not exist, okay? Let's just be clear here, okay? A lot of you kids are scared of monsters. There's no need to me. Monsters don't exist. Monsters, mermaids, spiders, plumbers, politicians, all fake, okay? Glad I cleared that up. You're welcome. You're welcome. Oh, the things you can think. Think of Peter the Postman who crosses the ice once every day and on Saturday twice to deliver the mail to a bunch of Wilford Brimleys. Think! Think! You don't have to use the exclamation points and the capitalization, but whatever. You can think anything that you wish. Think a race on a horse on a ball with a fish. 
That's a Japanese game show somewhere, let's be clear. Think of light, think of bright, think of stars in the night. I, I've seen that before. That's at the end of Kill the Wabbit. Think! Think a ship. Think up a long trip. Go visit the Vipper. The Vipper of Vip. And left. Think of left. Think about Beft. Why is it that Beft always go to the left? Who knows? I've been asking that question for so long. For so long. And why is it so many things go to the right? Uh, economic disparity, plus they're older. That's probably why so many things go right. You can think about that until Saturday night. Are those Mr. Steve's? Are those Mr. Steve's? Let me fix it. Kids, don't draw on your books at home. There, look. I've made them Mr. Steve's. Do you see them? I've made them Mr. Steve's. Don't try this at home, though, okay? I don't want your kids to get in trouble. I can do it because I'm an adult. Think left and think right and think low and think high. Oh, the thinks you can think up if only you try. And that's the end of that story. Yay! Did you kids enjoy that? I hope you did. You sick of being stuck at home? So am I. But an important note, you can still go outside and play. You can still go to the backyard and play. Or maybe get an adult, walk around the neighborhood, explore. We've got a lot of woods and shaded green areas around our house. And we've been doing a lot of nature walks and just exploring. And that's still allowed. You can't go to movies or the park or the mall, but you can still walk around and have fun and explore nature and see birds. So there's still a big world out there that you can go to. And I hope you do. Go out and enjoy yourself as much as you can, all right? We're going to get through this together. And I mean that. Mr. Steve is here for you, and I care about you very much. Hope you enjoyed that story. Next time we do a story time, we'll probably have to get back to the Potbellied Buddies series. Unfortunately, I still got three more books in the series. So we're going to have to do this, okay? But I know we can get through it. Now, if you will excuse me, I need to eat some chocolate-covered marshmallow eggs. A lot of them. Well, guys, we'll see you next time. Bye! Diabetes.